Penchant. A liking for or a habit of doing something. She had a penchant for musical experimentation. Master Bruce, you set off the alarm, sir. This somnambulism is becoming a problem. Especially for those of us with a penchant for sleeping at night. Gruesome. Extremely unpleasant and shocking. The newspaper article included a gruesome description of the murder. Scientists believe the rip is a gateway to another universe, but do not know what mysteries lie beyond. However, in this reporter's opinion, gruesome death awaits us all! <laughs> Disparity. A difference between two or more things, especially an unfair one. We are still seeing a disparity between men's and women's salaries. So the property is in a kind of limbo. It doesn't exist. Neither do you. I did a little digging. I recognize, Mr. Reese, that there's a disparity between how much I know about you and how much you know about me. I know you. Mutter. To speak in a low voice. He muttered something that I couldn't hear. You're muttering. I don't mutter. Ah, you do. You mutter less when something's troubling you. I blame you. Stubbornness. It's in Hallucinate. To see or hear things that are not really there. After two days without food and water, she began to hallucinate. It's the heat! To go back to the sea. Oh, Captain, you're hallucinating. Look. Did you... Loiter. To stay in a public place without an obvious reason. A group of teenagers were loitering outside the store. Chris, what the hell is going on with you lately? Ever since you hooked up with this band, you're like a completely different person, and I don't like it one bit. I am expressing myself! Now get out of my way! I'm going to the park to loiter! Treason. The crime of being disloyal to your country or its government. Richard is accused of committing treason against the state. That's bordering on treason. I'm just saying you could be king. You could do it. That is treason. I'm trying to get you to realize you needn't be governed by fear. I've had enough of this. Testimony a formal statement saying that something is true. In his testimony, he denied that the company had ignored safety procedures. Five. Oh yeah. Mm, 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 mm. Having heard some of the testimony over these jams I've been listening to, me and my crew were now kicking in the mix. Demolish. To end or ruin something completely. These ants can demolish large areas of forest. A superhighway, built from Denver right to our casino. And what do we do about the small town of South Park that lies in the highway's way? Simple. We buy it, 
and we demolish it. Ha 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 ha! Acupuncture. A treatment for pain or illness with needles. Acupuncture originated in China. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Ow! I thought you said acupuncture would make me feel better. Trust me, it will. It's just not easy, fine. Lurk. To wait somewhere quietly and secretly. She didn't see the figure lurking behind the bushes. Then the limo. What are we gonna do? We can't just stay here with James Woods lurking somewhere in the house. All right, does anyone have a cell phone? Huh? Recount. To tell someone a story or describe a series of events. Alan recounted how he and Joyce had met. Excuse me, friend. Where are you from, exactly? Small town in Indiana called Mercyville. It's not fancy, mind you. You know, we don't have any swimming pools, and thus no one ever recounts any swimming pool-related stories. But what we lack in place... Interlock. To join together firmly. A puzzle with 500 interlocking pieces. Although, when you think about it, Lego is the perfect metaphor for marital congress. Two pieces that interlock with a satisfying snap. <laughs> oh, that... Coronation. A ceremony at which a person is made king or queen. He was present at the coronation of Queen Victoria. Watch your step, please. The gates will be opening soon. Why do I have to wear this? Because the queen has come of age. It's coronation day. That's not my fault. Lethargic. Having little energy. I was feeling tired and lethargic. I bet you're a great dad. And three great husbands. Mr. Torpedo, I couldn't help but notice that the ball boy was looking a little lethargic. Yeah, he's got lupus or rickets or something. I don't know why we keep giving that job to these sick kids. I was wondering... Abyss. A very dangerous or frightening situation. The country might plunge into the abyss of economic ruin. I see a beautiful city and a brilliant people rising from this abyss. I... Deputize. To act or speak for another person, especially at work. I was asked to deputize for the head of administrative law in a meeting. I'm a fan of yours, and I think this blockbuster needs an impossible scene. Impossible man, I hereby deputize you for one scene only as an Avenger. Bicker. To argue about things that are not important. They're always bickering with each other over their personal problems. you said we were picking up drugs for Pablo Chacon. I thought we were, okay? Brad told me he was Pablo Chacon. How do you trust that guy? I don't trust you him, okay? You must right bickering now. for five seconds, okay? How did he even... F 
Antagonize. To make someone dislike you or feel opposed to you. The company doesn't want to antagonize one of its biggest oil suppliers. Your enemies are circling. When I am moves against you, our focus should be there. Instead, you antagonize her further by offering the Sky Crew a seat at your table. Vindictive. Unreasonably cruel and unfair towards someone who has harmed you. After the divorce, Joan's ex husband became increasingly vindictive. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said that. Because it wasn't nice or because it wasn't true? No, it's not true. Uh, uh, Mrs. Fowler is an angry, vindictive woman, whereas you are warm and, and loving, quick to forgive. Oh, please. But, uh, I'm Nibble. To eat something by taking a lot of small bites. A mouse has nibbled through the computer cables. Oh, Ted, I don't, I don't really... Oh, come on, I'll take a look at there. Oh, this do look good. Right? Go ahead, take a nibble. That's it. Away you go. Errand. A short journey in order to do something for someone. Before you disappear, I want you to do an errand for me. Oh, jeez, I, I, I woke you up. I woke you up. No, 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 it's okay. I needed to get up anyway. Are you coming in? No, no, it's kind of my only time to run errands. I just uh. needed to... <laughs> Recuperate. To get better again after an illness or injury. Ashley is recuperating from a sprained ankle. someone new. You have to be one person. I have to be a thousand. Today I'm a pastry chef. No work will I recuperate. I was caught in the crossfire of a drive-by shooting. Rustic. Simple in appearance, typical of the countryside. The property has a certain rustic charm. Welcome to the Lazy Eye Ranch, where we give you a week of rustic ranch living. Do you have an internet connection? Internet? <laughs> Some Susceptible. Easily influenced or harmed by something. Some people are more susceptible to peer pressure than others. My butt receives critical damage. <laughs> A leaf monster would be susceptible to fire attacks. Yes, I think most things are susceptible to fire attacks. Stifle. To be unable to breathe because you have no air. We almost stifled in the heat of the city. A friend in real life. You must admit, you don't really let me see my other friends anymore. It's just I love you so much, Louie. I didn't realize I was stifling you. I'm sorry. Come here. <sighs> Mutate. To change and develop a new form. Technology continues to mutate at an alarming rate. Temperatures, but what if that were to change? What if, for instance, 
the world were to get slightly warmer. Well, now there is reason to evolve. One gene mutates and an ascomycetia, candida, ergot, cordyceps, aspirin. Insurrection, an attempt by a group of people to defeat their government. There was an armed insurrection against the party in power.